Trail, which will be up next Friday, January 8th. I know we're getting back to the free tutorials once a month now that craziness of Christmas is over. So it is going to be done with our Bow Bunny Genevieve collection. What I've done for you so that you can get the paper kit ahead of time, excuse me, <clears throat> is it's listed on the website countrycraftcreations.com and it is listed under um, tutorial paper kits. That way you can get everything you need except for this couple of things I'm going to show you. Flat back pearls you're going to need and most of us already have those. Now I've used quite a few and I'm going to be honest with you, I get mine at Walmart and I'll tell you why. It, the Walmart EK Success, they have them in their most of their stores are the best that I have found and they're actually you know made by a subsid subsidiary of simplicity so they're wonderful quality they're always a beautiful shade they're not too yellow and that's what I use I love them I've gotten a bigger package this isn't the one I use but back in their scrapbooking so this is the the Jolie actually it'll go by Jolie Jolie's but they are made by EK Success brand. And the reason I don't carry these in the store is because it's a Simplicity, the pattern company, and you have to sell millions of dollars. And we're not there yet. <laughs> we're getting there, but we're no, we're not even close. These are the best pearls. I think they're wonderful. They're our Joann's don't even carry them. No, there's no coupons this way, but they're not really that expensive. The packages. Um, I don't have a package to show you. I did use it all, but they're they come in a bunch of strands and they're all one piece. Easy to cut apart. That's what I'm using for the tutorial. I wanted to give you a sneak peek, and I don't usually do the covers first, but this is going to be a different album. It's not going to be a complete album, so it's going to have some fun surprises in it for the new year. And we're going to go through the making of all of it so that you can get the decorating, um, the decorating of this part, making of the flowers. Now, I will, this is up also. I wanted you to get a chance to see, and there's pictures on Facebook, because I'll make it a little bit different for the t video because I don't want to make the same album twice. And then the chipboard. So, your collection, if you go to the website and you want to follow along, and I think. The whole price, it's not even, it's not bad at all. It's 27, goodness, I should have written it down. I had it up a minute ago. It's like 27, 25 for the whole thing. What you're going to get, six yards of your seam binding. And this is the same seam binding, but see, this is what you can do with it. And you're going to get um, the key and you're going to get these corners in your paper kit. Now here's the fun things. You're going to learn how to make ruffles. What do you think of that? Let me bring the camera up. We're going to be making these ruffles. Aren't they just darling? So we're going to make ruffles. Now these flowers were some I just had in my stash. But I'm going to show you how to make white ones. That light's terrible. We can punch these, not a problem. I just had these, so I put them at the top because we do have to be able to um, finish off that raw edge, just like you were sewing. So we are going to do the ruffles. And then here's the back. Now, here's our side. And here comes my cat. You'll probably hear my kitty meowing. So here is the the other side, and I'm going to go up even higher. And let me see if turning off this light will help. That just may have helped you. You're going to see a dog. You're going to see my belly, and you just might even see a kitty. So these are the ruffles. Again, we'll be making the ruffles. It's terrible at night, the lighting. Then we're going to do our binding right here our corset type binding using the yellow seam binding and see here's the differences you can take this seam binding because when you get it it'll be just like this then we're going to also crinkle it and make it look like this very shabby very vintage and then the flat back pearls now if you don't have flat back pearls because I'm trying to show you ways to make things without going out and buying things you can also use another piece of lace right on top like a really skinny I don't have a piece of lace. So if you don't have these, you don't have to have them. But if you do decide to go to Walmart by Friday and pick them up, 
and they have them, please, you're going to need at least three packages. So keep that in mind. You might want to use something else. Or if you have them on a roll, not to fix that. And then um, I also use my hot glue gun. So a lot for a lot of this construction. Um, and I have, I love the new Elmer's Craft Bond now that I've gotten used to it. It did take me a while. It's a little different to use. It's cordless. The Ow. And it's hot. The glue sticks come out very clear. So you won't have a yellow, yucky brown, yellow mess. You can't even see. You just, and you don't have quite as many of the, the threads. But um, the inside, I'm, I'm not going to show you yet because it's not done. <laughs> and that's that will be more of the tutorial. So you'll want a flower punch. Now let me show you the two punches that I used for the binding. Because think about a wedding dress. Sorry, I had to. Okay. Um, you're going to have to have something that we can get that we're going to put our strings through. So either one of these will work. If you don't have this one, I did get this at Joanne's not too long ago, so I do believe some of the Joanne's that still carry Martha Stewart. This is a smaller one, or you can jump on Amazon. I use this for so many things. This one is the second choice, because let me show you. I'm You're going to want to use, I'm going to show you different ways, though. You don't have to go out and buy these, but they're only $1.49. Um, they're the plastic. They're just the plastic uh, sewing needle. And this my kitty, move over. Trying to find where my package is because um, they do carry them at Walmart. They carry them at Joann's. And they are plastic. And you want this to be able to go through there. This one does go through very nicely. This one does not. It's a little tight and we wouldn't, you're not going to be able to use it. But I'm going to also show you how to use this by hand. So I also used, I have a serger. I love my serger tweezers. They're, if you have flower tweezers or some other long ones you can use, this will work also. So these are the things that you're going to want to get or use. And if you don't have these, don't worry. You can use a hole punch. You can use a hole punch. It'll just take you a little longer. You'll be able to stop the video, though. You'll have to make your holes, and I'll show you how to do that. And then, of course, in the paper kit, you'll get your hug, your hug snug seam binding. If you don't have this, any ribbon will do. Just don't go more than a half inch. You're going to want to go really little. Let me show you. This was my template. So you're going to go really little. Or you need to stick no bigger than this in your ribbons. And this one is a quarter inch. Your hug snug is half inch, but it's really soft and it's easy to work with. It's not, um, it's, it's softer than a ribbon so it works now those are the items that you're going to want and like I said if you want to buy them beforehand and have the exact same paper collection that I'll be working with then you can jump on my countrycraftcreations.com and pick it up and Friday night I'll be posting this so that you can start following it and have a wonderful crafty weekend Thanks for watching and I can't wait to show you the finished product that we make.